Can you tell us about you? I mean, how old are you? Which school you go to? What do you do? Just the basic. Well, I just turned 14 two weeks ago, and I go to school in inner city of Los Angeles. And um, when did you get your first computer? Um, my own first computer probably when I was a built one when I was um, nine. Uh -huh. But from then I started using my brother's computers and my dad's. And when was the first? How how and when did you come in touch with Linux and open source? Um, well, my dad was using like Ubuntu and Linux Mint. And so I kind of just got encouraged from him using it. And then that's when I installed Ubuntu and I started getting into that. So uh, weren't your friends using Windows and other operating systems? Why, what you liked in Ubuntu? Um, I just like how simple it is. And it's a, little, a lot easier to install applications. Uh, easier than Windows? Um, it depends. But it's a lot easier just going to the command prompt without having to instead of Windows going through the internet. Okay. And uh, now you are like um, a celebrity in Linux world, so... And um, have you... have you? No, that is not the right question. The right question would be, when was the first time you came in touch with any open source developer? When you... You know what I mean? Wait, what was the last word you said? When did you come in touch with the open... I mean, you were using Ubuntu at home, right? But when was the first time when you came in touch with any Ubuntu developer, or when was the first time you went to a conference where you meet other developers? Um, here, actually, this is when I got my first Ubuntu CD when I came here in 2011. So okay. Scale kind of introduced me to it. Okay. And who all did you meet? Everyone. Like, I know a lot of people here, and so I kind of just met the Ubuntu developers who mm -hmm. the stand. Mm -hmm. Have you met Linus Torvalds yet? No, I have not. Do you want to meet him? That would be awesome to meet him. So, so uh, in the Linux world, who is your idol or who is your icon? My idol, well, I have a lot of them because everyone in the open source is not like different levels of achievement. Well, there's the different levels of achievement. It's just because like everyone pitches in something. so. I kind of just like, I can't really pick one person, it's just everyone contributes something. Right. And in your school, they d do they use Linux and open source or not? No, our, our computer, our school's computers, they use Macs. Okay. Uh, but uh, but did you talk about Linux in your school to anybody or? Well, in my personal life, I don't really tell people that I'm kind of like computer savvy. I just, they just think of me as a normal person. Okay. And have you have you written any programs so far? Sorry. Have you written any software? Have you written any software? Oh, I, I do a little coding, but I'm gonna make a. I plan to make an app in the future. What kind of app? Next. Well, it's actually. I can't really talk about it too much. Okay, it's a secret project. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, it, is it for a desktop or mobile? Mobile. Mobile. Yeah. Okay, and and you also give a lot of talks, right? Mm -hmm. So, what are the focus of your talks? Well, most of my talks are focused towards teenagers, but a lot of adults come, so I kind of aim it towards them, too. Mm -hmm. And so the one I just did yesterday was called Automated Teen, and it was about automating your life through, with APIs and apps and other stuff. What do you mean by automated teen? Like, um, you know how teenagers, they're at school, and they need to automate their homework or something like that, just automating their life, it just makes it simpler. Can you give some examples of how, th what kind of things you would like to automate? Oh yeah, and so some kind of thing, I was talking about this in the talk, like a lot of people in the audience say they turn off their phone ringers and then they forget to turn them back on, and so there's an app I use called IFTTT, and it stands for if this then that, like the um, PHP code, and so that's one example of automating it. You can auto also automate your home, like there's a few gadgets, there's one I know called Nest, it's thermostat you put in your home is high tech and so those are just some of the examples I was giving. Right and you also gave a talk about the future mm -hmm. so where do you see open source and Linux in future? Well a lot of people in um, like Mac
my dark, he was the pre he was the past, and John was the present. And so when I was the future, I was talking about how Linux um, and open source in the future doesn't have to just be software, and how it can be hardware too. And I think they can do that with 3D printing. And my friend Jasmine's dad, John Cruz, he works for Tizen, and so I think Tizen can be the present too in the future. Right, right, right. And one last question will be that, what is your message for uh, people of your age? Um, my message for people of my age is don't be afraid to get started because a lot of people don't think that they can do stuff like this. Like if you just come to this text, like there's a lot of teenagers working through the hall and once they were exposed to all of this, they were much more comfortable. So I think everyone, like, since scale is kind of the only conference I know that's kind of geared towards adults and um, in trying to get a lot of youth in, I think coming to scale will be a really good first option. Okay, I have one more last question. And the last question is, what kind of support do or did you get from your family? From your well, dad, from your mom, them. from your brothers? Can you just mention something that encouraged yeah, or inspired you? Um, yeah. I actually had a blog when I was six years old, and so that was kind of like when I was first starting to get into tech, so I want to thank my mom for that. I also want to thank my dad. He pushes me to keep doing stuff when I'm kind of slacking and getting behind and stuff. And also my brother is just for everything. Like, it, just everything. Even letting me use their computers is all that. You have an awesome family then. 